I have to go because uh, it's I gotta late. get out of here. What do you mean it's too late? Oh no! I'm sinking, I'm gone! <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video, we are back in Tiny Sailor's World. And today, we are going to be doing something pretty special. Today, we are going to be trying to survive a U-boat challenge. That means we've got two U-boats out in the ocean, and we're going to be in a convoy of ships, and we're going to see if we can survive. We're joined by Jake Hillen, we're joined by Centrix, Britannic Enthusiast, and Royal Constructor. So a pretty big collab today. But yeah, guys, let's get into the video. All right, so here we have the RMS Titanic. I mean, it is April after all. And yeah, we're going to make our way to Southampton. However, Britannic Enthusiast and Jay Killen are actually at Halifax right now. And that's in between us and Southampton because we're actually leaving from New York. And that means that we're going to have to pass by them to get to Southampton. So it may be a little dangerous. Now, I believe I see Royal Constructor in the Wilhelm Gustloff over there, or Gustloff, however you pronounce it. I'm not sure where you are, Centrix. Um, I think you were going the wrong way just a moment ago, so I'm seeing if I can see you anywhere here. Where are you at? I was next. Oh, I'm, I'm next to the Satchel Orbitation. Oh, I do <laughs> see you right over there. So are you in the Britannic? Yes. Oh, awesome. So we're going to have the Titanic and the Britannic sailing almost side by side so maybe if you could slow down just a little bit i'll be able to catch up to you and also royal is literally right next to me right over here so we'll catch up to you and then we'll all go at once and see if we can just force our way past halifax and see if we can survive the uh the scary u-boats all right look at this this is awesome we got the britannic we got the titanic we got the willem gustloff this is awesome and look at this we're gonna be side by side here so, do you want me to lead? Because I think I can navigate us around safely. Um, we do have to worry about mines, which obviously the Britannic may have a little bit of a problem with. Right, Centrix? Yeah. Yeah, because... Just uh, a little bit. Just a little bit, definitely. So, let's go ahead, let's make our way ahead, and let's see if we can make our way to Southampton. You can see Halifax is directly ahead of us, so let's watch out. So, this who is in the Titanic? Oh, no, you just hit a mine! On oh, the no. starboard side, so click P on your keyboard, that will activate your pumps, and I would recommend clicking T as well, that will close your watertight doors, and that will prevent flooding. And actually, that's what I'm going to do right now. So, pressing T will actually stop the rate of flooding, while P will actually uh, basically bring health back to your ship. It'll pump the water out, and your ship will raise out of the water a little bit. But there is a cooldown. Wow. So you have to worry about that. But look at this. This is awesome. Seeing all three ships there. Even if Britannic is a little bit wounded. But luckily Britannic is in the middle here. So we're kind of protecting it. Yeah, not to really scare y'all. Uh, considering it's a very clear day. I can already see all three of you. Wait, really? Wait. Yeah. So can all the water be pumped out of the ship? Yes, actually it can. It just takes a little while. Because there is like a three minute cooldown, I believe it is, Jake Yeah, Hillen? something yeah. like that. So once that three minute period goes by you can just press it again and then you'll have more water pumped out and you'll raise out of the water and your speed will go up as well but just make sure your watertight doors are closed because when you do that that'll stop the rate of water flooding in and your ship will stop getting damaged periodically just check and make sure because obviously you want to be going as fast as possible oh and i just saw royal get hit by mine as well had i used the whistle i am uh, not sure yeah i think it's e that's what it is e Q is to turn off your lights, which will actually wow. help you a bit to prevent us from uh, detecting you as which easily. Button? Uh, Q turns off the lights, and E is Ooh, to that's sound a good the idea. Hole. Oh, nice! I see you are blowing the whistle over there. That's pretty cool. So, wow, we got our lights <laughs> off. So we're just going into this uh, almost like completely lights off and everything. This is awesome. I think um, Royal only needs to uh, turn his lights off. And then we'll all be, yep, there it is. Now we're all in the darkness, which may help us, as Jay yeah. Killen just said. I am actually a little frightened because we have been sailing for a while and we haven't really seen anything. And it's also dark out because obviously it's almost nighttime. It is nighttime, actually. So, yeah, I'm a little worried. And I would be really worried for both of you guys, Royal and uh, Centrix, because you're already damaged slightly. So, any blow from a torpedo or maybe another mine for that fact, could actually fatally wound your ship. But it looks like you may have pumped out some more water from your ship, Centrix. I don't know. Yep, I did. Oh, that's awesome. I do notice your speed's back up as well. What's that sound? I'm not sure. Oh, I better move out of the way. I'm on a collision course. I'll let you go ahead of me. 
So uh, there you go. Yeah, be careful. If you have PvP on, you actually can ram others and damage each other. So. Yeah, that would be bad. But look at this. This is awesome. Looking at the. Uh, oh my gosh. Uh, Centrix, look what? off to your starboard side. What is that? Uh, that. Hey, oh, 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 he's oh. been torpedoed. He's been torpedoed. Oh no. Oh, are you sinking? I am. Really? We've lost I'm the botanic. Good. Oh, you're still good. I can't use my pumps yet. Oh, no, but your watertight doors are closed, right? I think so. Okay, um, let's hope for the best there. I'm gonna make sure mine are closed. Oh, I just opened them. That's bad. There we go. Oh, no. I'm a little worried for Centrix right now. I may actually have to turn around, but I'm worried to do that because... Oh, no, he's oh. gone. Oh, no. He's gone. We've just lost Centrix. Centrix, I'm, I'm thinking. I'm stopping. So, um... If your ship goes down, which I'm assuming, yeah, it's going down right now. I can barely see it over there, but yeah, your flare just launched. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, there's your lights. I'm Help turning me. around. I'm turning around right Help. now. I'm coming to pick you up. I I'm going to say that might have been a mistake. Me turning, turning around? around? Maybe. Oh. Well, I don't think it's going to be a... Oh, my gosh. I just saw a torpedo shoot by. This is frightening. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm going down. Yeah, I see you over there. That is not good. Look at that. Let me get my binoculars out. Oh, what was that? I've been torpedoed. Using pumps, activating watertight doors. Might be Lyric, because I'm pretty far away. Oh, that's maybe. me, sir. Oh that's my me. gosh, that's frightening. Oh wow, look at the Britannic. It is going down super fast. Whoa. It's already in that vertical position where it's about to plunge. Alright, Centrix, I don't know if I can pick you up. I'm trying. He is heading your way right now, and what's actually interesting is obviously the, uh, the Willem Gustav actually did sink in World War II um, as a result of torpedoes being fired at it. So I'm actually surprised that uh, the Willem Gustav is holding up strong in this U-boat battle. Not to, see, not to threaten you, but I'm a little bit faster than you. And oh I my just gosh. died. Yay! Oh, did you just that. run into a mine? I think so. Oh, wow. Well then. Oh my gosh. All right, Centrix. Um, luckily, we have extra seats on our ship. So you can hop off your ship and hop onto ours, and we'll bring you to Southampton, hopefully alive. Um, the first okay. tragedy... Can you turn on your lights? Oh, I just got hit again. Oh my gosh, I'm getting fired oh, at oh, badly. Royalist going down? Looks like it. All right, quick, get on. If you haven't already, let me know when you're on. Royal. Oh, he's sinking. Oh, he's going down, yeah. All right, quick, Royal, get on my ship. Let's go. We got to get out of here now. All right, look at him. He's jumping into the water right now. And there goes the Britannic. Come on. Centrix, are you on board? I can't see you if you're on board. I'm so. on. All right, perfect. I'm waiting for Royal. Royal, quick, swim over here. All right, I'm just going. I have to go because uh, it's I got to get out of here. What do you mean it's too late? Oh, no. I'm sinking. I'm gone. That's it, folks. The Titanic is going down. And you can see in the distance, the Willem Gustav is doing the same. Yep, so there it is, folks. The Titanic is going down. I can see Royal jumping all over the ship there. The Gustav is still going down, though. Really? Taking yeah, I do see it just in the distance. I only had it once. Oh, my gosh. Not Titanic to concern is you, but I'm back. I'm on my way back. Oh, gosh. Yeah, because we're not just oh, doing this one time around. We're going to try again to see if we can try to make it there. So... Next time around, I'm thinking we should use some modern ships. Maybe we could see if we can actually make it to Southampton. That would be very cool. As you can see, Titanic doesn't have long. I'm going to leave the ship. You can see there's only one more funnel remaining as the ship goes down. It is uh, definitely going down very quick here, as you can see. The ship is beginning to go vertical, and it is going to the bottom. So there is the Titanic. You can barely see it there. But it is going vertical, and it is slipping under the waves. There are lifeboats literally everywhere, and it is clearly a sign of a major disaster that has unfolded. So, you can see there it is. The Titanic has slipped to the bottom, and now we're going to see if we can survive and actually make our way to Southampton. But this time, we're going to use some fast, modern ships. So, you ready, guys? Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's go. All right, this time around, I'm bringing out the MV Gillette 2 from the Gillette line. Or, well, really, the Andrea Doria. But uh, I do know that Royal is using the Queen Mary. And what are you using, Centrix? The 2006 Poseidon. That's right. We're going to have some modern ships. 
Let's see if we can race our way to Southampton. Let's see if we can survive. Let's go. Now, I assume that uh, Jay Killen and Britannic Enthusiast, you guys are already at Halifax and, well, waiting for us. Yeah, yeah. I'm still at Halifax, yeah. Oh, boy. Well, this is going to be a very frightening journey, but I hope for the best. Now I think about it, technically, uh, Centrix and Royal, you are using two versions of the Poseidon, because obviously the Queen Mary was used for the Poseidon from the 1970, uh movie can't remember exactly what year in the 70s but then you have the 2006 poseidon which is the more modern one well then i'm on my way to uh halifax now um i'm actually oh, wrapping time. around the uh, the island here but here we go uh, oh, oh no, no. Can't turn. i'm stopping my engines did you guys I just collide oh close. no it was so close oh thank goodness oh my gosh oh, that looked like a, a collision wow that was so close. You know, I think we should be worried about what Jay Killen just said there. Yeah, I'd be worried because I can see you guys as well. <laughs> I'm going to be way behind them, so if anything is going to happen, it's going to happen to them. But I am a little worried about them, as usual. I mean, they're sailing into, well, a frightening reality. Look at that. The lovely MV Gillette 2 plows through the waves no! with nothing ahead of oh, it. Oh, I saw oh, that. What just happened? Centrix hit a mine. Or, no, that was Royal that hit a mine. Oh, really? Oh, what? there are mines literally everywhere. Hey, here's a pro tip. If you look under the water during daytime, you're most likely going to see the mines below the water. So definitely something I would recommend. I see you guys oh, yeah, just um, zigzagging over there, too. That's uh, it's actually an oh, interesting yeah, maneuver. Oh, crap. You guys are lucky. You're all faster than I am. Uh-oh. That's not good. I'm so far behind right now. They are just specks in the distance. All right, so you guys are actually docked up, but I don't oh, even no. see the land there. I just hit something, I guess. Well, luckily you're at land, so that's the bonus. I mean, you're not in I total don't know danger. How to dock. Well, don't worry, just sit uh -oh. there. You should be fine. Ah! Uh, I think we might have a problem. What's going on, I'm Centrix? I'm kind of stuck on land. You beached yourself. Yeah, so I need somebody to ram into me. Don't worry, I am on my way. Royal sinking. Oh, no. In port. Wow. Um, you know what? That would be a good shipwreck to dive to. That would be. I mean, it's in shallow water. Um, mm -hmm. yeah, that's not good. Uh, Royal, get onto the Poseidon, and I would recommend, if you can escape, Centrix, escape now. Uh, I don't think that's possible. Well, luckily, I am here, so, um, I'm not sure where the U-boat is. Oh my oh, gosh, I see you. him. Wait, what? Uh-oh, that's not good. Zigzag, zigzag maneuver. No, 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 turn, turn, go quick. Oh my I'm gosh, that was close. Up. Hey, Royal, I might have you try taking over and see if you can get this out. Oh my gosh, there it is. The Queen Mary is sinking. The Queen Mary is going down. Forget the Poseidon, oh, I, guys. I, I got free. I'm yes, free. Yes, go, go, go. Let's move it. Let's get out of here. They're after us right now. Uh-oh. We got this, Royal. Go, go, go. Where well, we headed to? We're going as fast as we can towards Southampton. Let's go. Oh, oh no. no! Uh, use pumps or use watertight doors or whatever. Just keep sailing. Just keep sailing. Oh my gosh, you narrowly avoided. Oh, there oh, no. it is. There it is. Boyle, we're going down. Lyric, you just hit me. Oh wow, wow You're great. Dead. Quick, guys, go. Oh, my gosh. They are literally blowing your ship up right now. Go, guys, go. Swim. I think I see Royal. Yeah, he's swimming just behind me right now. You guys got to move now. Let's go. Come on. We got to go. Yes. Just find a you place to it. sit. Wow, that's uh, wild. Oh, no. Don't worry. You can just stand there or maybe you can go to the... St oh, there you are. All right, perfect. All right, we got to move. We got to move now. Move. Oh, we just got hit. Okay, pumps really? and watertight I doors. Think I, yep. I think I hit you from super far away. You're yep. about to get hit again, we... I think. Okay. Oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah. yep. Turn, 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 move. Oh, there are two torpedoes coming at us at once. Oh, we just narrowly avoided one. Oh, my gosh. We may make it, folks. We may survive. We've actually survived. Oh, that is not good. We are getting fired at from all angles. Quick, 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 quick. Go. Oh my gosh, we are literally getting fired out like crazy right now. This is unbelievable. 
This is so nerve-wracking right now. Uh -oh. I'm so worried. Luckily, guys, I've got the pumps running. I've got our watertight doors closed. We should be good for a little while. Um, I'm doing zigzag oh, hey. maneuvers. I can see Jill killing. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wow. That was very, very close. I just keep seeing these torpedoes going just yeah, you're straight by them. the stern. You know what's crazy? Oh, there it is. I was oh, just no. about to say, you know what's crazy? Your uh, Poseidon is still sinking, but... We just got hit, and I don't know what I can do. I mean, my pumps are no longer operating right now. I have to wait for the cooldown to finish, and we are now down to 15 knots. So, uh oh, I don't have oh, any options. I'm faster than that, so I can yeah, me up. too. I'm struggling. We will make it to Southampton one way or another. I'm sure you won't. Man the lifeboats, build rafts, close the doors. Now that it's night, it will be very difficult to spot. Oh, this is bad. We're done, folks. We're done. And it's done, folks. There it is. The ship no. is going down. All right. Get ready to abandon, folks. It's been nice knowing you on the MV Gillette oh, 2. The boats. Hello. Oh, the boats. oh, we've been fired at again. Royal, I recommend leaving the vessel. We have attempted to survive a U-boat attack. It has miserably failed. And we are continuously being fired at by torpedoes which is not helping our situation as we sink to the bottom of the ocean just outside of Southampton. So we were so close, yet so far. And our ship just got moved by one of the explosions. There it is. No, not the MV Gillette 2! How could you do this? Go oh, full speed. Oh my gosh, look at them. They're going at basically the same speed, just right side by side, attacking both sides of it. Look at that battle maneuver there. That's crazy. There they are. They are completely annihilating the MV Gillette 2. No mercy. No mercy. No mercy at all. The MV Gillette 2, really, the uh, Andrea Doria is sinking under the waves. And wow, I'm not even sure what that was. It just Whoa. got blown off into the distance there. And now it is really it going down. Me. I don't see it. It's right over here. Over here. It is. Oh, and it's gone. Well oh. then, folks. Um, So what have we learned today? Avoid subs. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Avoid Subway at all costs. I know their sandwiches taste good, but they are deadly. As you can see, we've been attacked by subs, U-boats really, and it was a miserable failure. But it was quite fun. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment, and I'll see you next time, guys. Goodbye. Bye.